Hello, dwellers! My name is Caveman Films, but before we get to the main video, I have some really awesome things to talk to you guys about, so hopefully you guys will stick through this. If not, you can skip ahead, it's like two minutes in or so. But, uh, yeah, so I wanted to tell you about some really cool things. The first thing is, I bet you guys have been wondering where my Minecraft server was going to be, because I've been telling you guys I've been working on it, and I have, but then lots of things happened, and... I really don't like things. Things are bad. But, on the good news, we're doing a lot better now, and I'm working with some really awesome people over at Beastnode that are actually the people that are hosting my Minecraft server for you guys, and they're really awesome. And so to say thanks, uh, I'm going to be telling you guys why they're awesome, which they're, they're just cool, so that's cool. And to tell you guys that if you guys are in the market for a Minecraft server, there's a link in the description below that you can go to, and it's like 20% off. So, pretty awesome. So, if you guys are looking for a Minecraft server, definitely check out Beast Note. They're very reliable, all that kind of stuff. Uh, next thing, uh, have you guys ever wanted to have me on your wall, staring at you for eternity, never blinking? Well, that's kind of creepy, but if you guys want, you can actually pick up a Caveman Films poster at MinecraftPosters.com. Uh, it was drawn by Finn's Graphics, awesome guy, and there's actually a really cool story to the poster in which I was just at Minecon, Finn's comes up and he's like, hey, I got a gift for you, and I was like, really? What is it? And he's like, boom, awesome poster! And I was like, dude, that's awesome! And so, uh, really, really awesome, and the cool thing is, is that the proceeds actually help Finn out a lot, which is really cool, so... If you guys want to, it's 24 bucks, uh, same price as everyone else, and I think there's even a bundle going on if you buy all the posters, uh, so if you want to help out Sky Jerome and I, me, <laughs> then go for it. But anyway, that's really all I have to say, links in the description for that as well, and I'll talk to you guys later, see ya! Hello dwellers, I have a few questions for you, have you ever felt tired in Minecraft? Just felt like you just needed something to drink and you get that extra kick in your step? Well, this mod is for you, it's the Minespresso mod! And it's really kind of awesome. And also, have you ever felt like a fool in your office space when everyone else is drinking some nice delicious coffee or espresso or cappuccino? And you're stuck at the water fu uh, water cooler. <laughs> water fooler! That makes a lot of sense because you sure are a fool for drinking water instead of delicious! Amazing coffee and cappuccino and espresso. Trademark. But <laughs> I'm actually kidding. Don't... You know, water's good for you. So is coffee, but, well, technically, it's kind of good. If you don't put cream and sugar in it, which is completely against the point of coffee. But anyway, welcome to my really crappy office set where I have my fake office worker, Jeff, here, who I did not kidnap from a random village, and I did not hide him and have him ransom, and the police are searching for him right now. <laughs> no, definitely not. But uh, he's just here, really, just to say hi and go, huh, every few minutes because... I feel like everybody needs to have a ha huh in their life. So, uh, really, really simple mod to install and have because it just involves a zip file, zip file, and you just drag it in, and then you got it. It's good. So, <laughs> anyway, let's show you how to make the Mind Espresso machine. Very easy. You just get some blocks of iron, get a button, and some sugar, and voila, you got a beautiful bona fide Mind Espresso machine in front of you, which is really cool because it gives you lots of drinks that have some good and some not so good potion effects and some really cool other effects too. So, if we go to the machine, you can see that we have six different kinds of drinks. We have coffee, cappuccino, hot chocolate, latte, tea, not tea, tea, and mine espresso. And it's actually tea, but whatever. Uh, we've got coffee. We got regular coffee, sleepy coffee. I'm just going to be taking the ones that actually do the effects. The regular ones don't have any effects um, because they're regular and whatever. Sugary hot chocolate, we've got experienced latte, we've got starving latte, we've got healing tea, and we've got magical mind espresso, and sugary magic mind espresso, and then we even have something called the bomb, which is really cool. So, let's game mode ourselves to zero, and you will be able to see what these effects do. So first things first, um, we're not going to be drinking extra death and extra hunger uh, until the very end, because those things are extremely bad. I don't know why you'd want to drink these unless you're trying to trick a friend. But, let's see, the first thing we have is coffee with extra sleepiness. And what's kind of cool about this is when you drink it, it actually sets the time to day and night. You sleep. You sleep for eight hours in the Minecraft day, so it was nighttime. Now it is daytime, and that's really kind of cool. 
uh, kind of defeats the point of coffee though because I kind of thought that coffee was supposed to keep you awake, but whatever. We got the cappuccino here with extra strength. And normally that'd mean it tastes really strong, but for this, it actually legitimately gives you extra strength. Look at that, we got strength three. Last time I drank this, I had strength two, so apparently it's random. But now we can just, just smack him so freaking hard. And he is going to die if I keep that up. But yeah, that's pretty cool. We've got the hot chocolate with extra sugar. Guess what that does? Guess what that does? Sugar rush! You can jump real high, you can run real fast. Really just awesome, gives you what, uh... <laughs> Look how freaking high! Oh man, it gives us, uh, jump boost and speed. And they're very, very strong. I also like how there's apparently a feather falling effect going on here. So you don't hurt yourself every time you jump. That's nice. Now we've got latte with extra experience. If you drink it, you get two bars of experience. Pretty nice. Over here we have tea with extra healthy. And if you drink it, it heals you. That's really all it does. And that's nice. We got the Mind Espresso with extra magic. I honestly don't know what the extra magic does, except it gives you resistance and invisibility. Where am I? You'll never know. Never! It's great. And then we have Mind Espresso with extra sugar and extra magic, which gives you all those things and renews your speed and jump boost. So you can literally be the fastest thing that you cannot see with the naked human eye. You should put some clothes on that eye, it's too naked anyway. Okay, so, next we're gonna game mode ourselves one more time, and we are going to go over here, and hopefully, there we go, Mind Espresso. We wanna get the bomb. The bomb is freaking crazy. Okay, game mode zero. When you drink the bomb, what do you think happens? Like seriously, what do you think happens when you drink the bomb? So, so we're going to drink the extra hunger first, and then show you what happens. So, when you drink extra hunger, you lose all your hunger bar. It's kind of stupid. Now you drink the bomb. And it gives you all of these things. It is the best. It gives you literally every single potion effect known to man. Isn't that great? It also gives you a little bit of hunger, and it's just great. You thought we were going to explode because it's called the bomb, and <laughs> yeah, I would think that too. But, the one that kills you is the final one, Cappuccino of Extra Death. Guess what happens? You drink it, you die. Why would you want to drink it? Probably didn't taste that good in the first place. But that's actually all the drinks that come with this Mind Espresso mod. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. We just spawned a little far away from the set, which kind of sucks. We're going to run over to it for no reason. I can see it in the distance there. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the Mind Espresso mod. It's just a cute little thing going on there that gives you some coffee and drinks so you can pretend that even in a video game you are completely and totally a slave to caffeine my name is caveman films hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and i'll talk to you guys later see ya now jeff i'm gonna kill you come on jeff no witnesses <laughs>